to the voting rights showdown in Texas with Republican lawmakers pushing what would be one of the nation's most restrictive voting bills in the country in a dramatic move overnight. Take a look. Texas House Democrats fled. They left the state on buses and planes to block the vote. That's right. And joining us now is Texas State Representative John Busey. And Representative Busey, you actually drove from Texas all the way to Washington, D.C. Not alone. You were with your wife. You were with your young daughter. Tell us why you decided to leave the state. Look, you know, to break quorum, we have to stay out of the state for a long time. These voting rights, we're fighting for voting rights. These bills that they're trying to pass in Texas would make it so much harder for the people of Texas to vote, especially women, people of color, and individuals with a disability. So we're committed to, to seeing this fight through, and that's why I drove here with my family. We, we could be out of state for a long time, so we wanted to stay together as we were here in D.C. fighting for voting rights. But the argument is, sir, you're only delaying the inevitable, that uh, eventually the governor could do another session, another special session. This could keep going on and on, so you're just delaying what's going to uh, eventually happen anyway. So is the point really to just get enough national attention to put pressure elsewhere because it, it, legislatively speaking you you don't have a lot of options here sure one of our main goals and why we're here in dc is to put pressure on congress to act we need to see congress pass the for the people act and the john lewis voting rights act that is vital to to voting rights across this country it's not just texas all over the south all over republican-led states we're seeing an attack on voting rights but i will tell you we broke quorum in the, in the regular session. We now broke quorum again in the special. We have shown the governor that we will continue to fight his voter suppression bills. And if that means using every tool in the toolbox from here on out, we will keep that on the table and we'll keep all of our options available to us. What if that means, sir, that you might be arrested? Because House rules suggest that absentees without a sufficient excuse for being there to vote may be sent for and arrested wherever they may be found. Look, you know, I, I think the Democratic caucus from the Texas legislature has shown that we're willing to do whatever it takes to stop these voter suppression bills. And if it means getting arrested, that's why we left the state, to get out of the, the control of the Texas DPS. Uh, we're here in D.C. and we're advocating just like people come to us to advocate for bills. That's what we're doing here. We're, we're, we're committed to this fight. Uh, we're not afraid of any threats of arrest or being brought back. We want to make sure that the people of Texas have full access to the ballot box. Uh, Representative Busey, there are, there are a lot of folks who agree with you that say absolutely you should do everything you can to stop these, uh, these types of bills. And then there are people on the other side who absolutely say they, they want the bills to go, th and, and that's fine. But at the end of the day, where is your responsibility in putting, getting everybody to the table? You're, you're not supposed, you, you weren't sent there to do this type of stuff. Why, why isn't a cooler head prevailing? Sure. Why isn't someone saying, let's get to the table and fight this out, argue this out, do what we have to do, instead of half of the, 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 the legislature fleeing to another state? <sighs> Look, the Texas Secretary of State, I serve on the Elections Committee, came to us and told us that the elections in Texas ran smoothly and securely and that they were a success. In the Texas legislature, our job is to solve problems for the people of Texas. This bill is not solving any problems. That's why we're not at the table. You can only be at the table when you're negotiating policy that helps Texans. This hurts Texans. And this is so important. It's the most important issue. That's why we're here. And my, my constituents elected me to fight for their voting rights. And sometimes that means walking out of the building. When are you going home, Mr. Busey? When are you going home? Well, <laughs> you know, we're committed for the long haul. That's why my family's with me. Uh, we'll see. You know, we're going to go home and whenever Congress acts or when, when the governor stops his suppression or as long as it takes. You know, the special session ends in August 7th. So we'll see. We'll keep you tuned. All right, man. Well, we know some people there. Or you can go to apartments.com. You can do what you need to do, man, if you need a place there uh, in D.C. for a little bit. Representative Busey, we're keeping an eye on it. Um, we will hope to uh, check in with you down the road. All right, you take care. Thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.